Hi, Sneaky Linux back tonight, and tonight we've got Tiny Core 1.2. An amazing little distro because it's only 10 megabytes. Yes, you heard that right, 10 megabytes. And you get a GUI with that. But you only get a terminal, a control panel, which you can do backup, restore, configure your net card. Luckily, mine was already configured straight away. And you can configure lots of other things on here too. So, yeah, that's okay. And it's very DSL like I thought anyway when I opened it up. But hey, I've not heard nothing from DSL for a while, so hey, let's give this a go. The thing is apps. You don't get any. Now this is the thing here. You just download the ones you want directly to RAM. The weird thing about this being is as it's only a ten meg ISO in the beginning, most of your apps are gonna be bigger than the actual operating system themselves. So anyway, we'll go along from there. The first thing we want is to get on the net, isn't it, really? So, here's Firefox. It's Firefox 3, so that's good. And all you do is install Selected. So we click on Install Selected. And eventually, what should happen? It should start downloading, which it does. But it also downloads all the dependencies that it needs. So that's one thing you ain't got to do. So anyway, as you can see, it's downloading quite a few libs here. Quite a few, quite a few. Still very DSL like, don't you think? But there was nothing wrong with DSL in the first place, I didn't think. If you like minimalist operating systems, this could be the one for you. But if you're going to run it from RAM all the time, you want to do this all the time, just from CD. You'd want to put it on a USB drive and do it from there. Anyway, I'm getting bored of all this downloading because it's making the video too long. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to edit a bit in a second. So we haven't got to watch all these boxes downloading. It took around about, shall we say, four minutes in total to download everything. Here we go, I've edited it there. Firefox is there. Starts installing. Quite quickly, really. And there we go. It's installed. And if you look down the widget bar down the bottom there, you've got a Firefox icon. So we're going to go and use that to see if it actually works. And quick it is as you would imagine, as it's running totally from RAM. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the Tiny Core page. Oh, I must make my typing quicker, my god. There's Welcome to Tiny Core Linux. We're going to click on there. And here you can learn all about it. If you like the OS, go and have a look, see what you think about that bit. So anyway, if you're out and about, you're going to want to do some stuff, aren't you, really? Because web browsers is OK. But hey. You might want to do a bit more, unless you use Zoho or some of the other stuff out there. So if you click on TCE again, I'm going to look for an Office app. There, I can't actually see Abbey Word or anything there. So I'm going to scroll down, because I think the generic should be there. Go a bit further, get flashes there. You'll need that GIMP is there. Lovely. Generic. So we click on generic. Do exactly what we did before. Install selected. So that's a 13 meg download, which is bigger than the ISO. So I'm going to skip that bit of downloading. So you haven't got to watch the little things go by on the bar and get really bored and go to sleep. There we are. Nearly done. Lovely. Installs itself straight into RAM. Lovely. Close it up. Click on close. Close down there, down our widget bar, we've got a little spreadsheet icon, click on it once, up it comes. Lovely, you can get a bit of work done. Now ideally, I'm not sure what this is actually for, but maybe for just purists out there, but I quite like it, it's not too bad. It's quite a modern version of Genumeric, not so bad, click OK there, we're kind of out of that. Now I'm going to keep my eye on this one. Because it does have potential. Where I don't know. I don't know where we're heading with this. Maybe we're going to this cloud thing after all. But I don't know. Anyway, Sneaky Linux out.